You know, the gold medal gymnast is saying that the sexual abuse lasted through two Olympics. Now, Michaela Maroney is breaking her silence to remind us all that whenever there is a position of power, there is potential for abuse. Our silence, she says, has given the wrong people power for too long, and it's time to take our power back. As an integral part of the 2012 U.S. Olympic gymnastic team dubbed the Fierce Five, Michaela Maroney stole hearts while bringing home the gold. Ladies, one right here. But this morning, Maroney coming forward saying there was a very dark side behind all those smiles and cheers. The now 21-year-old writing in this Twitter post that USA Gymnastics team doctor Larry Nasser sexually abused her repeatedly, starting at a Texas training camp, she says, when she was just 13 and lasting for seven years until her retirement from the sport. She writes, it seemed whenever and wherever this man could find the chance, I was treated. It happened in London before my team and I won the gold medal, and it happened before I won my silver. Nasser has been accused of molesting dozens of young athletes associated with USA Gymnastics and his Michigan State University Clinic. He's now in prison after pleading guilty to charges of child porn and is still being sued by more than 125 women, claiming he sexually assaulted them under the guise of medical treatments. Dr. Nassar abused me at the USA National Training Center in Texas. He abused me in California at meets and all over the world. Maroney's gold medal teammate, Ali Reisman, who was not treated by Nasser, has publicly accused USA Gymnastics of trying to sweep the doctor's actions under the rug. Maroney, who says she was inspired to come forward with her story thanks to the Me Too Twitter campaign, writes, I had a dream to go to the Olympics, and the things I had to endure to get there were unnecessary and disgusting. We should point out that USA Gymnastics has always maintained they had no knowledge of Nasser's abuse and that they are appalled by his conduct and sorry that any athlete has been harmed during her or his gymnastics career. Maroney finished her emotional post, guys, by saying, remember, it's never too late to speak out. He sure isn't. Well, thank you, Gigi. We're going to hear more and more and more stories of this, but like we've been saying, it's, it's one thing that we're, that we're talking about, it. what's great, but is this going to finally change? Are we finally going to see action?